Okay, let's start the video. I, I haven't done any video for part two for Pablo, so I'm going to roll over the list to Friday's Saturday show, and you can email me for the Mega Man and Pablo system. But before you guys get started the video, I decided to use the DZ Triangle Illustrator Part 17, and someone pointed out that my system has been working with the past draws for Mega Man and Powerball so far been tracking on Powerball using the teaser triangle and last night I did good and for those for those of you who got the list for Powerball Breakdown you know which teaser triangle I'm talking about Code Easter, Code Easter Pair and Code Easter Trio they are called the DC Triangle. You can subscribe, donate, share, and like my video. Use the closed caption button. Remember, nothing is guaranteed, but always trust yourself. And remember, email me for any game prediction at hyper underscore links at yahoo.com. And always remember, if you want to learn my lot of coaching system, hyper underscore links at yahoo.com. And finally, figure out what illustration is going to be. It's it was during part 1 to part 16. You can read it over here under my video, what it's about. Now it's going to be called uh, Deezer Triangle for now. I might change it. I'm going to track it a few draw, but the Deezer Triangle has been working so far for Mega Man. And sorry about that. And let's look at what I mean by the Deezer Triangle. And any game prediction will have the random generator also. It will generate numbers based on the ID seeker system. I'll try to generate more number based. Uh, and when I do generate more numbers, those numbers will use two different kind of combinations. Numbers that will have mostly the, tri uh, the triangle from the thesis triangle and numbers that will not. So in case the thesis triangle comes like last night for Powerball, combination of hitting that jackpot will be good. Now here's the thesis triangle. This triangle, last night's join for Powerball are 18, 43, 58, 60, 58, and the, uh, the, mega, uh, the Powerball is 14. So if you look at the Result, you'll see these numbers popping up in last night's drawing. And when they draw numbers, the random draw numbers, they're not gonna draw numbers in order. They're not gonna draw from lowest to highest. They draw random numbers after they draw the random numbers. As they say, you can try to group it, but they're gonna group it for you. Sometimes they group it for you on the site, on the lottery website. Sometimes they group it on the drawing date so but if they don't if they don't group it you're gonna have to group yourself from the lowest price and the lowest numbers doesn't mean they're starting from the first invisible number sometimes they skip the first invisible number last night was 18 for those who got the, the up-to-date invisible list you can see if the 18 was the first invisible number so last night someone someone pulled it to 23 from the combination as the lowest number for one of those lines, and that starting point wasn't 23, but they had 18. After 18, it went all high numbers, so that was a tricky part. After 18, they put it all high numbers, so the first infinite number was a key. And after the first infinite num number, if you think it's gonna come or not, if not gonna come, then it's, they're probably gonna pull second infinite number. After the second infinite number, you know it's gonna be high numbers. So if they pull the first infinite number, they have a chance to pull another first invisible, uh, invisible number, or they're gonna skip it. Now, using the, tri the DC triangle combination that was formed, combination that was formed were, were sorry about that, were 13. 18, 58, 
44, 34, 43, 18, 38, and 14. So where are your winning numbers in the DC triangle? 43, 34, 58, 18, and Mega Ball 14. So four numbers were in the DC triangle. So if you like the video and like to uh, learn the DC triangle system, you can email me for that. And please subscribe to me and share and like my video.